for the glamorizing. Creating images, driving a Lexus while you're fantasizing. Each time the memory carries us to the next. Good evening, fight fans. I'm Al Bernstein, and joining me tonight are my partners Max Kellerman and Teddy Atlas. Teddy Atlas, what do you think of this fight? One of the great things about Roberto Duran is he never gets hit two punches in a row. He might be lucky to catch him the first one, never the second. Teddy Atlas, tell us what you think of this fighter. Even though Julio Cesar Chavez is always aggressive, always pushing the issue, defensively, he's a solid fighter. And presenting first, fighting out of the blue corner... Manos de Piedra, Roberto Duran. And fighting out of the opposite corner, across the ring, El Gran Campeón Mexicano, Julio Cesar Chavez. And the referee in charge of tonight's bout is Mills Lane. All right, gentlemen, you've been through all the rules in the dressing room. I expect you to obey my command at all times and protect yourself at all times. I expect a good, clean fight. Are there any questions? All right, let's get it on. We move into round one of this scheduled 15 round. Teddy, what should we be looking for in tonight's bout? This should be a good fight here tonight, Al. Both fighters coming in here very evenly matched. Great punch there. Mm. Keep those shots up. This is your first warning. Mill steps in and gives him a warning. Hopefully that'll set him straight. Chavez. Falling short of the baby. Mm -hmm. There's another shot to the body by Chavez. Two shots and quick success in there, Al. Right hand shot there. Brutal combination upstairs. Wow, that combination upstairs had to hurt. Under a minute remaining in the first. Holland will lose the run. Well, that was a mistake in a close cost. Failing to get the distance needed to avoid that shot. Good use of the yard to cover up. Chavez seems powerful to push away from that game. Defending against that brutal cross. Sets up the hook with the jab. Bang! One, two. Answering with a great right hand. Solid cross by Duran. Locking to avoid that wicked jab. He covered up his head to stop that shot. Two uppercuts and quick success in there. Locking to avoid that counterpunch.
firm left hand to the head there. Now that is an excellent punch. Chavez blocking up top. He covered up his head to stop that shot. Doubles up on the jab. Yes, that's his work in the speed bag. Did you see the quickness of that shot? Look at this back and forth action. Round two is over. Let's take a quick look back at some of the action from the last round. And now we peek into round three. Blistering combinations to the head. Combinations like those are really going to open up chances for a knockout. Hard punch by Chavez. Now that was a big cross. Fending off that big uppercut. Scheduled 15 rounds. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Unable to dodge mm -hmm. the short jab. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Just unable to move quick enough to miss that shot. Mm -hmm. A punishing jab by Duran. Is in real trouble. It's going to be tough to survive these last two minutes. A struggle like this can really tag you even with a jab. look like after four rounds. Thank you, Al. I have scored 40, 35. Four rounds to nothing, the red. Doubling up on those uppercuts. Look, whenever you see two openings like that, take them both. Good left hand shot to the head there. This is a you hit me, I'll hit you bout. That's all. This is blowing your head. Time that time. Perfect. A powerful combination to the head by Duran. Two hooks in a row 
well there by Duran. He's used to the half punch places. Accuracy of the shots to hammering those openings. Now that jab had some power behind it. Guarding the head. That ends the fifth round. It's time for tonight's EA Sports Fight Trivia. Thanks, Al. This question is for all the movie buffs out there. Can you name the first movie about boxing? Well, it was The Ring, a silent film directed by Alfred Hitchcock, released in 1927. Very interesting, Max. Thanks a lot. Ooh, a punishing blow from the right hand. Get the distance needed to avoid that shot. Now that left is going to land movement or no movement. Good shot by Shadow. <laughs> Powering with the hook. That was a perfect <laughs> right hand. Firm shot by Chavez. Scoring shot there. Outside with that jab. Lined up for that one. So now let's view that vicious flurry of punches from the last round. We're set to go for round number seven. <laughs> Duran not getting enough distance to avoid that one. Jab there. That's the kind of quick combination any fighter would be happy to land. Even Sugar Ray Leonard said he really needs to watch for the left hand. Blocking up top. so far. Al, oh, this looks like a mismatch right now. I have a score of 69, 62. Six ooh, rounds ooh. to one, the red. Surely, you can't think of landing a right from there. Ooh, ooh. Textbook shot up top that time, now. With a good move right upstairs. Drop. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Go on. He was struggling to get up there. He needs to be careful. Chavez two. circumventing that right hand. I'm ready for that one. Two. 
That hook shouldn't have missed. Trying just a bit too much with the left. Duran not showing as much offensive capability as he has. He wants to avoid taking another uppercut like that. Duran is a thundering uppercut to the head. I don't know why he even tried this. It's all about survival at this point. <laughs> Avoiding the short jab. Thundering left. Tremendous hook there. The crowd seems to be appreciating something here. What could it be? So let's get started in round nine. Trouble right here. Yeah, he's in big trouble. There's way too much time left in this battle. Those uppercuts are just forcing their way home. Firm shot. Good counter cross. That's a wicked combination up top. Combinations like those are really going to open up chances for a knockout. Vicious combination for the head. Duran seems like he wants to prove a point, but this guy shouldn't even be in the same ring with him. Booming right hand shot there by Chavez. Trading shots in the center of the ring. Powerful combination up top. He just wasn't going to let that headshot get in. He thought that was coming from a mile away. Boy, it changed that time. Chavez not really pushing hard enough to escape him. Great shots in the head in that combination. That ends the ninth. One more time to the head by Duran. Excellent uppercut, followed by another by Duran. Failing to push far enough to have the cross slip by. Chavez, failing to evade the left. Had he really had him in the sights for that one. He's likely to avoid the short jab. But all you have to come back to that field, the idea is to move away from the punch. Down he goes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You're up. There it is, a knockout. Let's now go to Jimmy Lennon Jr. for the official announcement. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner by knockout, Manos de Piedra, Roberto. Good run.